Hi everyone and welcome for today's video. It is finally time and the event can begin. I've spent the last times organizing and mixing colors and prepping the canvases which are all 20 by 20 as announced in the event itself and I taped them all backside. I put some paper on here and some yeah, tape around the edges to keep it as clean as possible for you. So this is going to happen now. I've organized the canvases here a bit and these are the first ones to go. They are actually all the ones in the same color scheme and lucky me, many of you want to have a ring pour which gave me, well, a lot of confidence in making this pretty, hopefully. And also in the way my content on my channel goes because I recently just have so many ring pours and as you seem to like them it makes me even happier. <laughs> So yeah, this is going to happen. I will just pick the first one of them and let's say it's this one. And the first one is going to be Carrie Ham. So she sent me ring pours in your favorite colors, blue and gold. Let's go for it. As you can see here on the side, I've already mixed most of the colors that I'm going to use for the entire series. I will make today as many as possible and as I can store flat in the back of the room. And I will cut this video into pieces just to have it not too much in one, you know. So this is the emerald green. This is my thylocyanine blue, the gold. This is a metallic purple. This is a burgundy red. It looks pretty, pretty light, but it's going to dry really dark. This is a metallic turquoise. This is really pretty. Black and white. So let's start off with some halo blue. This is totally random, just how it comes into my mind. I think this is way too much paint as usual, so let's see how much of it I will need. Okay, I think this is going to try really pretty because the blue is going to be super dark. And I really like the design. I also have the good old jug ready to keep the drip of paint. You see, it's pretty full already, so it's time for a larger pour very soon. <laughs> so the next canvas that I pick is for... Trine Jord. Let's see what we get. We also get a blue and gold ring pour. So perfect. So we can use the rest amount of blue because this didn't even get the chance to flow out. <laughs>
Okay, I hope you like this one. I think it will be even prettier when it's dry and I can really see really fine gold layers of gold there. So I'm really curious how this one is going to turn out when dry. Next one is Rebecca Conklin. <laughs> So, same game. <laughs> Perhaps I can tilt it this time a bit. And pool number four is going to be for Oswald Cumberbatch. So this time we are going to have a gold and turquoise ring pool. I will add a bit of the dark blue for the contrast. So let's go with the next one. It is Rory. 
colors are going to be blue and violet towards the cool side and it's going to be a flip cup this time. So let's take a new cup here. Difficulty is, I didn't mix any silicone in my paints yet, so I will see if the flicking silicone will work here. If not, we will see where we go from there. need to fix this one. <laughs> I hope you like having cells. <laughs> so this is what I got here. I do not want to till too much more to not create too much awkward shapes when it comes to the cells. But so far this is pretty sweet I think. Do you like it Rory? <laughs> and here are the results of the first five pores in the dried version. They are not yet varnished but the colors will not change anymore. So I really hope you liked this video so far. The next five are coming very soon and in total we have 20 to go. Leave me your comments down below what you think about the five first results. Let me know if you have any questions and besides all of that you know what to do. Subscribe, like and share this video with as many as you can to help my channel grow. So thank you for your time, thank you for watching and other than that I hope to see you in the next video. <laughs> have a great day. Bye-bye.